Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add uh, a reverse signal into your timeline. Okay, we're going to grab a piece of audio here. The place you're going to normally see this is in a cymbal crash, maybe in a dance track perhaps, or a special effect in a movie or whatever. Um, so we're going to show you how to do that. It's quite simple really. Okay, first of all, uh, I'm going to do, uh, take out uh, just a normal cymbal crash. Uh, here it is here, and I'll let you listen to it. Okay, so to reverse that round, so we get that kind of, it sounds as if it's been kind of sucked out. Um, so what it sounds like is, uh, what we do is, first of all, go to Audio Suite, and go down to Other, and then you'll see Reverse. So click on that, and then all we have to do is highlight the area we wish to be reversed, which is this signal here, and then click on uh, Render, and that's it there. And that will reverse it. So you can see that the signal has been reversed just now. So just to let you hear that. So that effect is given to you there. So what I'm going to do actually up here, I'm going to replace a bit of my my drum track here with this symbol uh, reverse. So I'm just going to find the section I want. So I'm going to take out this section here, which is, if I just zone in a little bit more on that, um, Actually, we're going to put it in bars and beats. Okay. So I'm going to take out two bars there and just delete that. And I'm going to, well, I don't have to paste it in there, but I could for the sake of uh, showing you continuity there. I could paste that in there. So there's a kind of break there um, in the in the beat. Uh, the reverse symbol and it comes straight back into the beat again. So let's listen to that sounds like then. So you can see it gets the desired effect there of a kind of crescendo, uh, kind of tension building. Uh, and you can see it can be used in, in many different applications, really. So that's reverse audio. Simple as that. Audio suite, and then just click render here. Once you've got the, the area of the clip, you could reverse any area you wish uh, just by highlighting it, really. So if I wanted just a small area, you could take it in grid mode or slip mode. Uh, if I wanted a little bit of that area there, just <laughs> reverse for whatever reason. Click render, and it will reverse that for you. So that will sound a little bit strange, as you will hear. Here it comes. Okay, uh, and that's reverse audio in Audio Suite in Pro Tools. Thanks for watching.